right here for the XFL. And here we are. The LA Wildcats and the Houston Roughnecks begin their franchise history. James Butler on the return. Out across the 30, a little running room. What a way to start for Houston. Walker, with time, takes the shot. Cam Phillips, caught. Touchdown, Renegades. What a beautiful deep ball. Cam Phillips is a guy they've been raving about in their camps, that he is their best receiver, and they've got a guy named Sammy Coates on this roster. Uh, we'll try and add the point after. Draw play goes absolutely nowhere, so they do well executed. And they play. get a free first down out of it. Little end around run. Pitch made to Kermit Whitfield, and Whitfield deep into roughneck territory. Out of the shotgun. Knopf over the middle of the field, tipped and caught! Nelson Spruce inside the five after it was deflected by DeMarcus Gates. What concentration by Spruce. And how about the pocket presence from Knopf? He knows he's going to get hit, and he just hangs in another. Knopf holding on, keeps it, diving, touchdown, Wildcats. Here's Knopf rolling. Fires it, and it is caught for the conversion. Runs out of time, hit, ball still alive. And it looks like Houston recovered. Ken Burnett, the linebacker, comes in, gets the hit and the recovery. Well, we're going to have to see if Kanoff's arm was coming forward here. That was very awkward because it looked like he was trying to get rid of the ball. Watch as Kanoff starts stepping up in the pocket. And right about here, it looks like he wants to throw the ball and he kind of shoves it forward. It looks like that is moving forward and releasing. Hurt shirt to me looks like that's an incomplete pass. Yeah, uh, once again, all plays are reviewed by the replay booth. And you can see this looks like it. I agree with you. I think it's a forward pass and not a fumble. But well, now takes your head, headache away. Whatever it takes, right? Whatever you believe. Here's Kanaf. Nelson Spruce catches that one easily out across midfield down as well. Kanaf over the middle. Spruce down on one knee. Here's the same formation. This is dual right. Let's see if they go right back to that flat. And they did get the first down. They go to the end zone. Caught. Did he stay in bounds? Smallwood. That's too easy. That's way too easy. Great play caller, defensively or offensively. Don't get bored. Here's Walker bringing it down. And still keeping his eyes downfield. Sammy Coates makes it pay off. First catch of the game for the former third round pick of the Pittsburgh Steelers. How about that play? That was gorgeous. It looked like P.J. Walker had a bunch of room to run, but he finds his wide receiver. Gets that winds up being a 24-yard penalty. Walker under pressure. Dumps it off. Butler out of the backfield. Down the sideline, into the end zone. Touchdown, Roughnecks. A little Houston hop. So good for them in the slot. He's there now. Get off looking that way. Rose. Your guy. First. The clock stoppages the college has and take him a step further. We'll get to that in about 50 seconds. Wide open. Whitfield. Play official can provide input on a player safety issue. Call or no call. They talked through it, they communicated and, and made the right call. And Nick Novak. The longtime NFL kicker gets a 35 yarder, and the lead is now five. Eel on the football for a, a minute 45 at the end of the game is going to provide more exciting football at the most exciting time. That's an exciting play because that was a live football. James Butler scooped it up, trying to take it to the house. He doesn't get there, but he's into Wildcat territory. A minute 10.
yards on the touchdown. And as Walker breaks out of the pocket, watch as he gets out to the left. He's got a scoop under the rush, and then right here he gets out to the left. He locates his wide receiver because Roman Tatum had to make a choice. Do I need to come up for the mobile quarterback and leave my receiver or stay deep? He decided he was going to come try to defend P.J. Walker, and Walker astutely delivers it over the top to Sam Mobley. The clock ready to play. He's got to be ready right now. Oh, and they boy. didn't do it. Mismanagement. Mismanagement. Wow. And so back-to-back -back mistakes at the end of the first half the cost Winston quarter. Moss and his Los Angeles Wildcats an opportunity to take the lead instead. The hometown Houston Roughnecks will go to the locker room of 18-17 here at the half. Crutches. Under pressure. Escapes. clock at one. They get it off. Over the middle. Nick Holly goes up. Pulls it in. First and goal. That throw was unbelievable. That's one of the toughest throws in football. Over the linebacker, between the safeties, and Holly goes up with no fear whatsoever. Walker. Looking that way open is Khalil and it's the fourth touchdown pass of the game for P.J. Walker. L.A. No. LA knows it. Look right here, you got the safety. He's trying to, he's trying to inch out right now. Walker on the keeper gets it. Dragged down his feet under the tackler. Let's hope he's okay. Castillo puts it through. The lead. Bottom of your screen, he's the single wide receiver. Here comes the blitz. McClendon fires. Bouncing around. Picked off. Dietrich Nichols with the interception. At the end of that first half, and they were unable to get points because of the mismanagement of the clock. Quick pass out to Malone. First down, Roughnecks. And their coordinator. He needs his defense to get a stop here. Third and short. Walker zips that one, and it's caught by Khalil Lewis. First and goal for Houston. And a and a Butler. Touchdown, Houston Roughnecks. The Houston fans love it. Roughneck fans and all of you that took the over on Fox Bet love it as well. They get it. It's a 20-point lead. And this is what we've seen with this being the first game. Under pressure. Oh, he's been under pressure far too much. Here's the putt from Austin Rico. Good kick. Roman Tatum bobbles it. And look who's there to make the tackle. Sword. <laughs> Go get the guy with the ball. That's right. Here's Kanoff from behind. Ball's out. Fumble. Cowboy worked. That was DeMarcus Gates. But well, they went back and got it right, so it's third and one. Walker towards the end zone. Picked off. First turnover of the night for Houston. Ladarius Wiley flips it back. Runs it. Gets the first down. Keeps the drive going. But probably should have slid as long as... And this week, if you're a Houston Buffneck fan, it's the kneel down. P.J. Walker, June Jones, and the Roughnecks will win their first game here in the XFL. 37-17 over the Los Angeles Wildcats.